I think the EMBO meeting is really special in the sense that it is supposed to gather all the best people in Europe in many different fields. So if you want to really know what's going on, not only in your field, but also in other fields, I think it's really the place to come. Definitely genome evolution. I think we're in a position now where there's enough sequencing data from genomes to start to make some really exciting comparisons between genomes. And we've got four great speakers all working in different organisms, and I'm really looking forward to that. So I have three speakers that are really invited. Lucy Shapiro, who is working on a wonderful organism which is called Colobacter. Then my friend Bonnie Basler, she is really the queen of bacterial assemblies and she's really a very, very good speaker. So the last person I would like to mention is Brett Finley. So Brett has been working on pathogens for many, many years. There's a fantastic uh, lineup of neuroscience speakers. Uh, Richard Axel is giving a keynote talk. And then there's a plenary session on brain and behavior where we have Corey Bagman, David Anderson, uh, Edvard Moser, and Florian Engert. Uh, and there's really exciting development in neuroscience now where the tools of molecular biology, molecular genetics in particular, are being used to study brain functions at the circuit level. And all five of these speakers are really pioneers in that field. So this, for me, is going to be one of the great highlights uh, of this meeting. Network, network, network. Don't talk to people you know, unless you absolutely have to. Always talk to somebody you don't know. Go to the speakers' lunches. Make sure you make use of the career days and career sessions um, and have fun and learn lots. For the art lovers, you know, go, and go to the Leopold Museum, the Albertina, the Belvedere. For the music lovers, there's a Musikverein, the, the Staatsoper, many great concerts. And for anybody, just take an hour or two to spend some time in one of the many lovely Viennese cafes. It's a great place just to spend a few hours wandering around the city, enjoying it.